Hey guys, and welcome to our Hardcore Survival series. And I have just recently downloaded the new Skyrim pack. So I think it looks quite cool. I mean, look at that, that is amazing. <laughs> but I just thought I'd try it out, see what you guys thought. Cause I quite like it, but yeah, it's up to you. You want me to keep it for when we fight the Ender Dragon or not? I probably will just to see what it looks like because I've beaten it in everything else, so why not? Um, so, as you can see, I built a power one bow and extended that out and from that I tested it and we got no it's not in there we got um, two endermen to spawn and so we have two eye of enders somewhere um, not eye of enders, ender pearls Somewhere. Um, I don't know. The iron armor looks amazing. As you can probably see, I'm uh, one of the Dragon Lord people. Servant to the Dragon people. And basically, iron armor looks like dyed up, whatever you call it. Um, yeah, I think it's quite cool. But, um, what do you guys think about it? So, got music, this switch are loot now. Gas tier, sugar cane, redstone, egg. Hmm. This is strange. I don't know where I've put them. Um, same with the um, bliss powder. This is weird. Um, did I put them in one of these chests? Nope. No. Okay, this is slightly... Oh, I know where I put them. The only problem with the current setup is, of course, that um, it only works during the night. So that means that we can do something else, I suppose, while we wait. But I believe um, I put them back in the thingy. And we got 54 arrows. Ow. That wasn't very nice. Um, yeah. I think we got 54 arrows. Right there. And so that should be enough to kill a couple of creepers and stuff that happen to spawn. But I made it a bit bigger, big enough to uh, have endermen spawn in it on the night. What I found out is the island over there that also spawns endermen on the night time because it's in the middle of water. But yeah, here we go. 13 blaze rods, 2 ender pearls and I don't know why there's a mushroom. But let's just... Everything in here, um, apart from the arrows, and we still have a lot of cobblestone as well. So it is afternoon, so um, 
think this works. If not, that's the end of the series. No, that worked. Okay. Um, basically, um, I've got to put stuff in the chests, get some food, and then it might be night time, and then we can find some endermen. We've got full iron armor, so that's strong enough, I think. But what we're going to have to do is... How are we going to get the towers with the metal covering? That is the main question. Because we're going to have to scale up there. But I don't know how we're going to get down. Unless we bring lots of ladders. And then we can ladder up. Maybe. Yeah, we'll do that. Um, it's nether bricks. Let's get... Got some diamond left over. And there's not much point in making another sword or something. So let's make a diamond axe. And we never even used that one. Diamond pickaxe. But, yeah. We've got the um, cocoa beans that we've not even used. Oh wow, look at these mushrooms. They look quite cold. There we go. So we restocked on our food. <coughs> so I think we may have a mushroom. A uh, mushroom? A pumpkin, but I can't be too sure, because that would be quite useful on hard. But, we'll find out. Right, yeah, let's just get some wood and then this is what we can do. Just make loads of ladders. Oh! So, instead, why don't we just use buckets of water? and just have a couple of buckets of water with us then that way you can just scale up and there's water to fall down in yeah I know it's quite a good idea I'm sure you have to do that in uh, some adventure map called um, no what's it called um, escape craft I think for PC I think that's something you have to do is use a bucket of water to climb up a wall so if we do that then even if the ender dragon does knock us off it might not kill us straight away hopefully and then we can take him out quite easily as soon as all his stuff is gone and then once we get the dragon egg I think that's the series done. Oh, of course, we've got to place it somewhere. Nice. Right, there we go. So we have 56 wood, and do we have any cows? No. Okay. If for some reason this is a sheep. Doesn't really look much like a sheep to me, but I don't know. Ah, there's a cow over there. The thing about loot is you get more than what you would normally. Does it? Oh, I wish you'd drop cooked pork chops. That'd be so cool. Fire aspect automatically cooks all food. It doesn't, but that would be cool if it did. Right, so I think we want about 20 to 24 ender pearls. Because then we've got enough to find the stronghold. And then we've got our axe. Uh, pickaxes. <coughs> Sorry about that. 
our pickaxes to mine down to the stronghold. And then as long as we have plenty of food, we'll be fine. Alright, so we've got two buckets already. Right, two buckets. If we fill them with water. Right, two buckets of water. That might just be enough. Plus, when we're fighting the Ender Dragon, we can just stand in the middle of the water. And then Endermen will attack us. Oh, that's smart. Why did I not think of that before? Um. Right, let's go kill some more Endermen. Now I believe if you hit them in the legs, um, they're less likely to teleport away. I don't know if that's true, but let's hope so. I wish I had a little bit of food as well. See, this looks like food, but it's actually gunpowder. I think it's like the potion ingredients supposed to be from uh, Skyrim. Not too sure, but that's what I think anyway. It looks quite good, cold stuff. Right, something should start spawning soon. Right, that's a creeper, I think. Creepers and spiders mostly. Don't think there's any endermen. Don't break my door. Alright. Oh, I do apologize. That's just my alarm for uh, going to college on the days when I'm there early uh, late even how many arrows are we going to get back? I'm guessing not that many maybe half of what we initially had The rotten flesh does you good. Right, um, we'll go over there and see if they've got any uh, endermen. Oh god, <laughs> I don't like that. Makes me think I'm gonna die. And as you guys know, if I die, that is the end of the series because, of course, we are doing it on hard. The only difference is I will have to automatically delete the world myself rather than something else doing it for you in the coding. Of course on PC they don't have that uh, on Xbox they don't have hardcore. I'm not sure what endermen actually look like. 
with this texture pack. Um, but I can't see any at the minute. Long, thin, anorexic person, anyway. That skeleton just spawned there. Um, great. Run. Right, there is none. Okay, at least we know that. Um, will it be safe for going across land? I don't know. There's a lot of mobs spawning here. Uh, creeper. Alright, um, no, there isn't any. See if we can get a music disc. Come on, skeleton. Shoot him. Ugh, don't shoot each other. Jeez. <laughs> it's a right bow battle going on there. Oh, well, that's kind of annoying. Didn't get a music disc. Oh, well, let's go back up and see if we can get any Enderman to spawn. Uh, I should have brought a boat, really, but... I didn't think we'd be there for this short of a time. I thought there might be at least one. Anyway, if we go up here and there isn't one, I will start collecting some and I'll be ready for the next episode and we're now poisoned or whatever it is food poisoning oh hello creeper It's daytime. Right, guys, I will cut and see you next time when I will have the 20 odd endocles that we need.